Hello good friends, hope you are doing well. This is mathematics and in this presentation we want to look at this interesting question coming from the 2023 GCE paper one. The question was question number two. The question reads, simplify two in brackets we have x plus 3y minus 3 in brackets on the other side we have 4x minus 2 and the number of marks allocated was 2. First thing, identify the topic from which the question is coming from. What topic is this? This is algebra. Correct. Algebra. And the stem of the question says what? Simplify. Are we solving? No. Are we factorizing? No. Are we evaluating? No. We are simply simplifying. Now what does that mean? It simply means you make it easy or shorten the number of terms. That is to simplify. Now let's look at the question in detail. So we are given this expression. And in that expression, we need to simplify. The first thing you need to do is to look at the expression that has been given to you. This expression has got brackets. That is your starting point. So in short, I'm saying, whenever you are given an expression that has got brackets, you start from there. So we are going to get rid of the brackets, but how do you do that? You expand in this way. 2 times x. You're going to get 2x, all right? Plus 2 times 3, you get 6, the variable y. Minus 3 times 4, you get 12, variable x, like that. Then this negative and negative, you multiply. Negative times negative, that will give you a positive. So that will be positive. Then 3 times 2 gives you 6. That is your first step. So in this step, we have get rid of the brackets. They will not be able to appear here again. Are you seeing that? The next item or the next step will be collection of like terms. Those that have got x, let them be together. So we have two x here, the other pair is here, negative two of x, negative two of x. There will be no change of sign here. This is an expression and this is algebra. You only change the sign when you are dealing with equations. So here you carry it the way it is, then we have plus six y, then plus six. The next step will be, like things can be added, they can also be subtracted. That is the rule. Okay? And unlike things cannot be added, they cannot be subtracted. So here, we have these are like terms because there is x, there is x. So what is 2x minus 12x? What answer would you get? Others would say 10, which is not correct. Look at this. You have 2 minus this. You also have 12 minus 2. Are these two the same? No. Here you are going to get negative 10. Here you get 10. These two are not the same. So the answer that we have here will be negative 10x. See that? Then plus 6y. Then plus 6. What next? Look at the terms, three of them. Can they be added? No. You cannot add this. Why? They are not like terms. So this is your end. That is the correct answer, just like that. So the two marks you have, the method mark here, one, your final answer mark, one. You get the entire two marks. I hope you have enjoyed the lesson. Bye-bye.